Devin acknowledges that the match against Petrenko won't be easy, but he sees himself as the favorite, estimating his chances of victory to be between 53% and 56%. In no way in my mind do I think that this is going to be an easy match. Uh, in no way do I see my chances. Sometimes I have matches where I'm like, I'm going to kill this guy. Um, I, I, I view it as highly contested. Um, I give myself like a between a 53 and a 56% chance of victory, but that's all I need. Devin points out the advantages both he and Petrenko will have in the match. This guy is the best. He's, he's the current oh, world title oh. holder. He, he destroyed in his last few matches. He's been so dominant. What are my advantages? Hand size, arm length, experience. What are his advantages? Explosiveness, strength, youth. Mm -hmm. I think that if the match stops, I hope that my endurance will carry through after the cut. Larratt admits that it's likely Petrenko will control the center of the table at some point, but his goal is to secure a favorable hand position that will allow him to wear down Petrenko's wrist. In my mind, the most likely scenario is he controls center, at some point, I take the hand. The real question is, do I stop him? And where do I stop him? If that mm. match stops close to the center, it's going to be a terrible day. Terrible mm. day for him. The more likely option is that he gets me quite far. Maybe he beats me the first time. Um, but I will continue to chip away at that wrist. This is, this is what I plan for.